Hey guys, welcome to my channel Tokyo Foodie Sarah. In this video today, I'm gonna show you things you must eat in Fukuoka. And I am at an izakaya. Yay! <laughs> and I have five people staring at me taking this intro, so I'm very nervous. <laughs> Number 1. Izakaya Izakayas are Japanese drinking slash eating bars. This Izakaya Tetsunabe serves a lot of local food famous in Fukuoka. This place was recommended by my family's friend. These are all classic Fukuoka dishes. So I came to an Izakaya restaurant that specializes in Fukuoka food. My mom's friend from back in China took us here and we are having a lot of speciality dishes so yeah i hope everything will be good as usual i got myself a glass of highball whiskey with soda we got this we call it hormone but it's not actually hormone it's just like intestine um mixed with veg so intestine and veg stir fry it smells really good intestine Okay, I'm gonna try out the starter set. So we have the ordinary mentaiko spiced pollock roll. Mm. And then okuto. Apparently, it's similar to um, kokoroten, which is like something I'm used to. And apparently, it doesn't have any flavor, so I'm gonna put some soy sauce on it. Mm, that's interesting. And the intestine. I still have five people staring at me <laughs> under this massive pressure. Fukuoka is also famous for these hitokuchi gyoza, which means bite sized dumplings. Mm. Mm. It's very, very garlicky. It's so nice. I can literally eat like a hundred of this. <laughs> so we got the um, mentai iwashi. It's sardines with spiced pollock roll and the spiced pollock roll within the sardine. It's very interesting, isn't it? Apparently, you can get these in like supermarkets. So I'm gonna have a look. Mm. Got some more. Yeah. I got myself the sake. No, it's called Isonosawa. Iso Isonosawa from Fukuoka Prefecture. Mm, so I got the junmai. So it's got a very ricey flavor and it's very very smooth. Mm, no one comment on my red face. Number two, yatai open air food stalls. End your night off with more alcohol and ramen. Fukuoka has a distinct yatai or open air food stall culture where people gather around this small food stall to have some alcohol and nice food. You can go to yatai as your first stop of the night, but since a lot of these dishes are small, I recommend you to enjoy yatai as a second or third stop of your night. I highly recommend the naka naka naka. The staffs and customers were really amazing. Fukuoka has two major food stall areas, Teijin and Nakasu. I will explain this in a future video, but I didn't really like the service at Nakasu. Number 3. Tempura Hirao A local who's a viewer of my channel recommended me this restaurant. I didn't know how it worked until I entered the restaurant, but you buy your ticket on this machine and give it to the chefs inside the restaurant. I came to this tempura restaurant called Tempura Hirao and it was recommended by my viewer who lives in Fukuoka. This restaurant only operates within Fukuoka and it has really really good reviews so I am pretty sure that it's gonna be good. Let's see. That is the sauce for tempura and that is a starter. It's salted squid. And then what surprised me was that they bring you a freshly made tempura one by one. I'm gonna be first trying out the prawn tempura. So they give you this sauce and you dip it in the sauce, right? And just dig into it. Mm. With the rice. Mm. Because they literally just fried the tempura, like literally in front of you. It's so fresh and it's so, so crispy. But it's not heavy. It's not too oily. Probably because it's just been fried. That is on another level. Oh my god. Mm. And I'm 
gonna try out this mysterious squid looking side. Mm. I think it's squid marinated in salt, but they also add yuzu inside. That's quite rare. Very nice. Mm. That's it. And then onto the white fish. Mm. Oh my god. That is so fluffy and nice. Mm. Mm. And they also give you chicken thigh tempura. Mm. Pumpkin tempura. One of my favorites. Mm. You see, the batter is amazingly light. And I can't believe you can have freshly made tempura for this much money. It is very, very reasonable. Oh my god. I really, really hope that this restaurant comes to Tokyo. It is amazing. It can't just be in Fukuoka. It's such a waste of the talent. <laughs> I went in just after the restaurant opened at 10.30 a.m. so the place was not so busy, but there was a long queue as I was leaving. The end of the queue even reached outside the restaurant. I recommend you to go early if you don't want to wait for too long. Number 4. No. Unagi at Yanagawa Yanagawa is referred to as the City of Water or Venice of Kyushu and is just about an hour away from central Fukuoka. Yanagawa is famous for their fluffy eel or unagi. It's a must-have when you visit Yanagawa. Mm. Oh my god, the unagi is extra fluffy. And also the rice. The rice has so much flavor, it's very very good. Mm. Number 5. Umegae mochi at Dazaifu. Umegae mochi is a must-have when you visit Dazaifu Tenmangu, one of the most popular tourist sites in Fukuoka. Mm. The red bean paste has the perfect sweetness, and oh my god, the outside is so crispy, and the temperature is just amazing. Mm. Number 6. Yasai Makikushi Yasai Makikushi is a veg skewer with pork and is a famous dish in Fukuoka. This restaurant called Hakata Toranoya is a restaurant that specializes in yasai makikushi. They have dishes other than yasai makikushi too. I ordered mentaiko, spicy pollock roe, which is a speciality from Fukuoka. Mentaiko. Mentaiko. Wine from Argentina. Kampai. It is full body. Goes well with the meat. So here they give you three different kinds of powders. Um, that that has chili. One one sort of chili. One type of chili. That yeah, seven types of chili and some other things. Some other seasonings. And that is curry salt. That's interesting. And the staff recommended me to put this on the veggie sticks. Yay! So I'm gonna try out the pork stick. Butabara, pork belly. Mm. Look, it is so juicy. Look at that. Whoa! Oh, it's hot. Mm. Guys, that is extra fatty and it's so, so juicy. Oh my god. It's like one of the juiciest pork I've ever had in my life. And by the way, Fukuoka is famous for their pork yakitori. Like yaki. Tori means chicken, so it's technically not yakitori. But when meat is on skewers, they normally refer it to the pork, not the chicken. It's interesting. With the vino. I'm gonna try putting the chili flakes. Yay! Oh. And 
these yakitori places, they normally provide you with this cylinder-looking thing, so you can just put your skewers here. Convenient. So we got the veg skewer. We have meat wrapped around veg, different kinds of veg, and here we have um, yam, and here we have shiitake. Ooh, oh my god, that looks so freaking juicy. And here we have the spring, like the onions, very soft and sweet onion. And this is young corn, like small corn. So I'm gonna try the pork wrapped around yam and also shiso leaves. Oh my god, it smells so juicy and very, very long. Bakey, what's the word? Um, smoky. <laughs> The yam is extra creamy and look, the pork around it is very very crispy. I love the difference in texture. It's so nice. Mm. And now onto the onion. Onion and meat. Skewers. Mm. And shiitake mushroom. I love shiitake mushroom, like grilled shiitake mushroom. They ve they're very very meaty. They even taste like meat sometimes. That is by far my favorite so far. So good. And onto the corn. Mm, it's so sweet. So nice. So here we have the second batch. Look, it looks so good. So here we have spring onion. So this one is nira. It's um, it's a veg that's kind of similar to leek. I'll look it up and find it for you. Um, so nira and also cheese, tomato, mozzarella. Oh my god, I have my eyes on this. Um, asparagus and also what's this? Perilla leaf. So here we have the lettuce skewers. One of my favorites. There's so much lettuce inside. Woo -hoo. Now I'm gonna put the curry powder on the lettuce skewer. <laughs> You see, the lettuce is still kept crispy, right? So it really, it's really like crunchy in your mouth. And also the curry powder, oh my god, it brings up the flavor a level, a few levels. Guys, every single one was good. So it's very, very hard to pick my favorite. But if I had to pick, mm, I mean, the shiitake was nice, the lettuce was nice, um, tomato was nice. What else? Asparagus was nice. I think I'd go with the ordinary lettuce because it's really refreshing. But anyway, like this restaurant is so friggin' amazing. The staff is amazing. The food is amazing. The atmosphere is amazing. So if you ever get to come to Fukuoka, make sure you try this place out. Number seven, Motsu Nabe. Motsu is intestine of chicken and Nabe means hot pot. Chicken intestines may not sound very appealing, but this milky broth with Chinese cabbage and Asian chives it tastes like heaven. It's so good. I had my motsunabe at this restaurant called Oyama at Fukuoka Airport. This time I am having motsunabe. And motsu is another thing you must try in Fukuoka. Look, it's so wobbly. <laughs> Yay. Mm. I feel like motsu could be like a, an acquired taste because it is quite crunchy. And it's kind of slightly meaty, but not as meaty as like red meat. If that makes sense. <laughs> mm. I came to a Motsunabe restaurant at the airport, so you can find a lot of Motsunabe restaurants like in the city, even outside city as well. It's definitely worth trying. And you get a lot of veg as well, so you get like cabbage and like some leek and also ooh, burdock root and also some tofu. Mm. Yes, mentaiko again. I think I had mentaiko every single day when I was in Fukuoka. Just like any other hot pot, you can have noodles or rice at the end. And I got noodles. Mm.
I didn't film an outro, so here's the voiceover Sarah ending the video. Thank you very much for watching. If you liked the video, don't forget the like and the sub. Bye! Hey guys, welcome to my channel Tokyo Foodie Sarah. In this video today, I'm gonna show you things you should. <laughs> これ間違え。間違えました。テクツ。テクツ。テクツ。プレッシャー<笑><笑> <プレッシャーが。笑> So we finally got the veg skewer wrapped around the meat. Wrapped around meat, you don't know. Okay, I'm going to try out the yam wrapped around shiso and ram. No, no, no. I keep doing this. <laughs> no, it's not focusing. There we go. <laughs> 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 <laughs>